Hey guys, just a guy here with another episode of City Skylines. Uh, we're gonna start a new city today um, with mods this time. Uh, the last one was at 110,000. Uh, it recovered on its own. It actually didn't have to do anything after the massive problem with the thing. It just took time. And I was gonna get aboard and I was running out of space because I had no mods. So I was gonna do a modder thing. And basically this is the ones I'm using, at least so far. I've been looking. Um, so we got the Achieve It, the Mod Checker, you know, Pedestrian Bridge Builder, Big City Second Up 25 Tiles, Landscaping, uh, Font Selector, just because I have trouble reading some of the smaller things. This is like the difference it makes, by the way. This versus this, which I have on a 40 inch or whatever TV, because it's high def and I like it. But it does make reading some of the smaller text harder. The problem is it can cut off some of the text on like the buses, but whatever. Hard mode, um, sure, why not? Uh, and then in harmony, which is like just a requirement for some other mod, road anarchy, uh, FPS booster again, just a requirement for something else. Move it. Oh, I don't have network extensions to one. Weird. Okay, networks two, parallel road, proper tree anarchy. Uh, prop precision, which is a requirement. Prop snapping, a requirement. Uh, Uncontacted tracks, which is a requirement. Roundabout builder. Uh, the traffic manager. Uh, it's the labs version, so hopefully it doesn't cause problems. And then basically unlimited money's off. I do have unlimited ore and oil on because I just want to have to keep relocating my businesses. And unlimited soil. Because landscaping in the last time when I built the Panama Canal thing in my base. My my finger actually my wrist hurt from holding down to get dirt and remove dirt and then obviously I don't have any luck all. So we basically got the standard buildy ones. Um the Biffa uses a lot. These are all the popular ones I saw on the mod page and then their requirements. And then I did look for a map. Um I haven't actually played very many of these. I played the one map or whatever the game came with, and then all these others came with the DLC I bought over time. I haven't actually played them, but I saw this one and it looked kinda cool. I like this one too, Harold Bay, or Harold, like Harold with an A instead of an E, it's weird. Uh, it has this nice little ri river in the middle that goes to both sides, but it's super flat, kind of boring, so I went with this one. It has all the connections, and I thought it looked pretty cool. Alright guys, so this is the map. It is actually pretty cool. Got a nice little river, it's got the little Panama Canal bypass already built into it. Uh, the starting square has all the connections it has highway obviously um train and then it does have ship connections and it does contain water obviously so i don't really care for the train tracks being right down the middle or that huge intersection like the buildable area of your first square is actually fairly limited like you're gonna have to delete this whole thing eventually because Nobody wants to have the center of their city basically be a highway intersection. But, um, yeah, I kind of like this map. Um, I'm not sure how well this is going to go, guys. I've never used mods on this game before. And uh, I don't know any of the shortcut keys or anything. All I've ever done is maybe watch Biffa use some of them. And I honestly can't remember what he buttons he pushed or whatnot. I never looked up the controls, really. Um, In terms of assets, I have not downloaded any yet. I was looking through them, but it's kind of hard to judge between the garbage ones and the ones that are kind of overpowered. So we're going to go with nothing for now, but I'm going to look, keep looking and find if I find one interesting. And then if you guys want to make a suggestion, uh, feel free. Okay, I guess we have to use this road just to get everything started. All right, we got air. I wish that didn't pop up every single time. Can I move it? Yes. There we go. Um, let's see. So, where do we want to build? We have some ruins, this river. We are going to need water. Uh, which way does it flow? Okay, so it goes left, up, and around. Okay. Which is very odd. It goes up the hill. Or it goes upwards. I thought it would be going downwards. Alright, so. 
First thing we're going to do is put down our pump because we don't have enough money to waste on a water tower just yet. I do like to go to water towers eventually. And then... Where's the square end? Right there, so we'll put our sewage outward pipe right there for now. Um, I'm not using these water treatment plants that came with like Sunset Harbor, I believe. I don't see the point of them because they basically are used if you have nowhere for the water to drain to. Um, I don't like the eco water one here costs more and does less, but it still has a 45 pollution. I don't see the point of it because even 1% pollution will get your people sick. So I don't see the point of having anything less than 100% um, pollution free. Like if it's not pollution free, you may as well just not have any pollution prevention at all. All right, so we got that. Now, where do we want our city? Um, I guess off one of these little intersections. Let's see, this is a really weird thing, but we can't replace highways yet, so we don't really want to mess with that too much. So this goes off. Really no good spot to have good coverage, actually. Um... This will be down here. Either way, um, let's see. Two lane plane street. Huh. Oh. Basically has no sidewalks. That's very weird. I guess it's good for if you don't want pedestrians walking everywhere. Um, one lane one way with two bicycle lanes. So I do have network extension. I guess. I was hoping for, oh, what's this? Tiny roads, okay, okay, that's why I was, everything was weird. Uh, two lane road, basic road with median, basic road with median. So we don't have any fancy bike lane roads unless we get those little tiny roads. We have some big roads already, I guess that's from the network extension too. That's kind of cheaty, I guess, but whatever. So we'll just plop something down. All right. Now it does cost more money. All right, and then how about these are tiny roads. One lane with two bicycle lanes. And then let's turn off this stupid thing oops oh wow uh, my default controls aren't working I guess every new game or maybe the mods disabled it I normally just push 2 to make a bendy road interesting I'll have to fix that before the next episode let's make this isn't nice big circle earlier thing all right and let's that's that's probably gonna cause some massive traffic problems in later by the way but let's just zone some massively important Stuff. Let's do the riverside. So far, mods have not come into it too much. But I haven't done anything really fanciful. All right, let's unpause that. Oh, connected to the highway. That might help. All right, so we don't have highways yet, unless the mods gave us some now. So we're just going to turning lane. Okay, basic two-lane road with an additional 
Starting turn lanes and no parking space. It supports mediums and local traffic. Note, the turning lane goes in both directions, so collisions may occur. That's interesting. Um, asymmetrical road. Yes, please. So, as they come out, they can turn both directions. But as they're going out, they only need one. That is, that's a good thing. Um, and then we'll do the same over here somewhere. Just because we need a connection on the other side of the road. Well, I can't. Oh. Keep it in pillars. There we go. All right. Oh, it's a one way in the road. It doesn't need to be asymmetrical. Okay. I'm an idiot. Da da da. Oh, definitely got to fix that. Um, my upgrade buttons and all that are changed for some reason. All right, so there we go. Oh, we need power. So we have the coal plant, wind turbines. We don't have access to that until 1,800, which is actually pretty low for... That. If I remember right, these aren't really any better than this one. I think it's just like base. Yeah, it's basically just a different look. Um, two megawatts. Wow, we're not getting much wind here, guys. Seven. Seven. Not a high wind zone. Uh, it's out of limits. Basically, all the dark zones for wind are out of limits. And I don't know what mod makes that, but that's nice. Letting you see the wind levels. Okay, so if we quickly... Connect these. And we're connecting them just like, you know, in vanilla. Because if you don't have all your power lines connected it'll tell you you have power when buildings don't have power there we go we have power and water all right we are losing money obviously because we have no city yet still have a demand for uh, housing and now we need some industry. Now, I'm actually curious, how well is this working? Anybody using the bikes? No. I mean, there's very few people here so far. That was a one way street. Why were the people going the other way? All right, so let's, uh, Look at our options. I need a policy. Population 700 first. So we have 76 people. Um, let's see. They need jobs. Where do we want to put the jobs? I guess over by the sewage plant. We'll just use a standard vanilla road. I do hate to not have my buttons messed. Curb road. We're not going for anything fancy. Just the circle of doom. And it's not even the good circle. Okay, so. Input, output. Okay. 
There we go. People can get in and out. It's the ugliest road. But this map, I don't know, man. This highway in the middle just is not suited to building around. Can't wait to get rid of it. I do like all the water features around me, though. Oops. I don't like that tool. Oh, yeah, water, power. Uh, let's... See if we can bridge it. Save some power lines. And some water. There we go. Unfortunately, we don't have enough uh, demand. Oops, we need these. Get rid of all these. Hopefully they'll fill in over here. Or not. Guess we're wasting a power line. There we go. We've almost gotten to 157,000. We've lost quite a bit of money though. In fact, we're still not making a profit. What's our taxes at, to be honest? Uh, yeah, um, yeah, we got way more of this than we need. I was not paying any attention to the money. I did not. I built roads kind of big. There we Oh, I can't have the taxes page yet. Still losing money. Let's make it up in volume, I guess. Let's see, people can go over here to get to work, right? Yes. And then some shops. We'll put it on this nice two-lay street here. Okay, we're making a profit, guys. $71, $81. Guess commercial is the big money maker earlier on. Oh. Uh, our power is not enough. I'm going to have to find another place to put a power thing. We're just barely making it right now, but all these shops are building. Although we do need water, right? No. I don't even have enough to build a wind turbine. That's interesting. I'm not sure why I seem to have so much trouble with money in this particular run so far. I did kind of build my roads big, and I don't know how much this one lane bike lane road costs for upkeep. I didn't pay attention. Let's see. 33 per cell, which is cheaper, I guess, than a normal two-lane road. But I don't... Wait, is that somebody on a bike? Yes, but they're not even... Oh, wait, no, are they walking? Yeah. They're not even using the bike lanes. I mean, come on. The cool thing is the bike lanes, I don't think, are one way. I 
don't know, they're going fast, but it doesn't look like they're on a bike. So I don't understand it. Uh, what's this one? Not enough workers. Time for us some babies. With water, of course, because we're nice. Redlining on power, though. All right, we got landfill, of course, school, and a clinic. We can do taxes now, though, which is good. Uh, we're just going to fix our taxes. Yeah, 9%. Screw you, people. We're going to 12. We need the monies. We went from like nine hundred dollars a week to a thousand. So we're up to twenty-seven thousand dollars already. We were at not enough to even buy a power pole. I think that's an improvement. Uh, wind turbines, unfortunately, do not have a lot of great spaces. Six, six, five, six. It's like six is the best we're going to get. There we go. We have especially solved the power problem. Uh, not enough workers, right? Oh, garbage. Yeah, because I just got garbage. Landfill. Now, there's actually a thing where you have to fill up three of these. Um, let's see. My city is not the best designed in terms of ut services. Don't really want to pollute everything over there. So we'll just make people go really far. Uh, clinic. Why not? We'll put it on the middle street. And we'll put a... Have any industry yet? Got a clinic. What else? Is that it? I thought there was like a fire station or a police station. Oh, school. But that is twelve thousand dollars we do not have. Just yet. Our people are dumb. We shall uh how we say make money happen. We're just going to print money out of nothing. Surprisingly, that didn't change my income by that much. Oh, we're losing people. Go back to the nice, uh, great 12%, guys. I mean, after 29% tax, isn't I great and generous for only 12%? There we go. Yeah, everybody's happy again. What a busy uh little pastor. If I had toll roads, I could make some money. Although toll roads in general barely pay for themselves. Okay, so we're doing good. Just spamming things down, really. That car just like totally drove over all the grass. And I guess this is the only part of the entire city that has any parking right now. I think it might be one of the first assets I look for for the next episode is parking garages. I always thought they were cool. And unless you use all the roads, they don't have good parking. But see, look at this. All these people are on the street. They're going, I mean, it's on fast speed, but they still seem to be walking fast. Nobody is using the bike lanes. I don't know if I have to get to a certain... Uh, level to unlock bikes. Policies at 700. Maybe when that can include everybody likes bikes. But so far, we're doing okay. Um, noise pollution is bad in some spots. Uh, 
Commercial, obviously. These people aren't going to be happy in a little while. We don't have landscaping to put down trees or anything. But we'll get rid of that eventually. Uh, we don't have public transit at all. So our traffic... I mean, it's 78. Oh, that reminds me. I have traffic manager on. I can turn off despawning. This particular road is pretty busy for some reason. Okay, now how do I get traffic manager to turn off spawning? Let's see. Bulldoze. Not sure where it is. Hmm. Ah, oh, here we go, maybe. There we go. TMP Labs. Currently enabled easy mode, less traffic jams. No, we want to turn that off. Hard mode, bigger traffic jams. Okay. That was the big one. I, that's one of the main things I wanted modded. I mean, it's not going to be an issue right now. I mean, this is freaking population 600, but still. We are going to call this an episode, and this is our very ugly, very nasty city. Um, just the City Mark II, maybe? I don't know. I haven't really came up with a name yet, but if you guys have any suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. Uh, this is uh, Just the Guy signing off. Catch you guys later. Bye.